Some scary moments for bank employees and customers inside. FBI agents say a suspect robbed a Metro bank while wearing a motorcycle helmet. But this morning's robbery isn't the only one. They believe he's connected to others. Fox 25 Charde Gray shows us where the most recent bank robbery happened. Right now, this is a completely different scene compared to this morning when police swarmed this bank after FBI say a suspect robbed the bank wearing a helmet. And now they're saying he's connected to other bank robberies. Oh, this is crazy. I can't believe this has happened. Jeff Dudley was next door as FBI agents say a man wearing a motorcycle helmet approached the counter at Mid First Bank this morning demanding money. And there was a customer in front of him as he entered the bank. And he merely put his hand on, the, on that customer's shoulder and then went forward to the counter with that customer. So he never took anyone hostage either inside the bank or outside of the bank. But FBI agents say what he did take was cash. Left the bank and got onto what we describe as a sport motorcycle, black in color, with a large, looks like aftermarket silver pipe on the side and the license plate was removed from the motorcycle. Dudley tells Fox 25 his mom just missed the situation. My mom was there, she said like 35, 40 minutes before that happened. If this robbery sounds familiar, the FBI says the same suspect is connected to two other robberies. Bethany police say Monday the suspect tried to rob an IBC bank, but before he could get to the door, bank employees locked it after noticing his helmet matched a description from another recent bank robbery. About two weeks ago at IBC Bank on Portland, agents say the suspect showed a semi-automatic handgun to tellers and demanded money. He soon left on a white sports bike motorcycle, similar to the one agents say he used today. Hopefully they catch him soon, man. That'd be nice. FBI agents say the suspect was wearing similar clothing items to the other bank robberies, saying he was wearing black gloves, dark pants, and a smoked out helmet. In Northwest Oklahoma City, Charlotte Gray, Fox 25 News.